Hi, I'm Sam with Cultural Tourism DC. Today we're going to go on the Downtown Heritage Trail from Civil War to Civil Rights, one of the 11 heritage trails throughout the city. We'll see Lincoln's inauguration to assassination. We'll also see where Martin Luther King finished his I Have a Dream speech, along with other marches that took place in the district. We'll also get to see the flavor of downtown Washington, D.C., and it all starts right here at the National Archives. Across from the National Archives, you'll notice the first sign that directs us on our journey. Abraham Lincoln celebrated his second inauguration at this site, which is now the Smithsonian American Art Museum and the National Portrait Gallery. On April 14, 1865, you would have seen John Wilkes Booth run down the street just minutes after he assassinated President Lincoln at the Ford Theater. Pennsylvania Avenue is our next stop, and it leads us from the Capitol Building all the way to the White House. President Lincoln regularly visited this church during his time in office. One of the great things about Cultural Tourism DC's Heritage Trails is that they give you information about sites beyond just the monuments and federal buildings in Washington DC. But since we're in the neighborhood, let's visit the White House. Hi Mr. President. There are some infamous hotels in Washington, D.C. This is one of the good ones, though. The Willard Intercontinental Hotel housed President Lincoln the night before his first inauguration. And in August 1963, Martin Luther King Jr. put the finishing touches on his I Have a Dream speech. After that nice walk, I'm back at work, right here at good old 1250H Street Northwest, home of cultural tourism DC, right along the downtown heritage trail. So that's convenient. Thanks a lot for watching. Hope to see you again soon.